Bad Emojis tweeted, and they have revealed the $1 billion vehicle. So let's just jump right into the tweet. All right, so we're right here on the official Badimo Twitter, and as you can see, this is the first tweet. They pinned it, and they said, here's your first look at Blade, our newest 1 million vehicle to hit hashtag jailbreak. This futuristic vehicle flies just like a very fast, very low-flying helicopter and features custom engine sounds. There's going to be new engine sounds, ground effects, and more. More update info tomorrow. So it looks like tomorrow they may have more info on this new vehicle. So one thing that gets me really curious is, so I'm really wondering if they have any special abilities. So I'm going to comment over here. Are there any special abilities that come with the blade? You know, I I'm, I'm very curious, right? And we can put an emoji thinking... I'm not that sure, so that's why I'm going to ask, and, you know, let's just hit the reply button. So, you know, if you go over here, as you can see, I'm at the donut shop right now. If you just go outside, you can see there there are three uh, $1 million vehicles. There's actually more. Is that a police officer? Okay, that's not a police officer. So, as you guys do know, the military helicopter over here has, you know, I guess three special abilities. You see on the very side, you can shoot a missile that will damage people. Yes, you can shoot a missile. You can also drop a bomb. And that was added, you know, the last, it was like a year ago, I think. And, you know, the first special ability was the rope, of course. So, you know, each $1 million vehicle, I'll expect it will have a special ability. Like, you know, I guess the monster truck has special ability, you know, of being really good at, you know, terrain. You can climb over terrain with ease. Vault bike, the same thing. And, you know, the $1 million vehicle should have the same thing as well. Oh, yeah, speaking of Twitter, make sure to follow me because I'm so close to 1,000 followers. Yes, anyway, just speaking of that, let's go head over to Asimo's Twitter because he also said something about it. Let's go to Asimo, as you can see over here. He says, the Knicks $1 million vehicle. It's really good looking and super futuristic. Obviously, it looks literally amazing. I forgot to show you the screenshots. So, over here, wait, hold on, sorry. Okay, I, I just, I'm all over the place. Stop. So, on the first screenshot, you can see there's some smoke right over here. There's some smoke. And why have not liked this yet? Like it, yes, there we go. And as you can see, there's some smoke, and it looks like there's two passengers. And it seems that it flies not that far off the ground, but it makes me curious. Can the police actually eject you? The police needs to, like, jump, like, ten feet in the air like Superman just to... I, I don't know, but I, obviously it shouldn't be that overpowered. It doesn't look like it's too off the ground. Like, I mean, if you just jump, you should be able to jump on it. And then uh, over on here, as you can see, yeah, they have an interior, and there seems to be, like, a little touch screen... And then there's a steering wheel, and as you can see, there's smoke. So I'm curious, can you? Is there actually wheels, or is it just always off the ground? So is there like a button where I can disable this smoke, uh, you know, hovering effect, and it'll just like put some wheels? That's the only thing I'm curious about. And then over here on this screenshot, you can see the back there. There's the tail lights and th th there's the smoking effect and stuff anyway with that said we know that there's going to be new radios and you know one million dollar vehicles so i'm actually not sure if there's more on this update but i'll show you as you can see this is going to be like the new radio ui obviously if you go over to jailbreak right now and you can see if i use the military helicopter and i push r th this is still the old radio ui from like two three years ago so it is pretty old so i understand why they need to update it, so, I mean, this looks pretty good. They now have a custom station playlist, but the only reason why I don't I don't like the radio is, you know, Roblox bans copyrighted IDs because, you know, it's copyrighted, so I don't know if it's really going to be an improvement, but now you look like you can save your favorite IDs and then you can play it without having to, you know, copy and paste every time, so that's pretty good for the whoever, if you guys own the radio game pass. And then secondly, if you didn't watch yesterday's video, they also revealed there's going to be more customization options, like, you know, they're adding a tint options to the jailbreak garages, and this is what it sort of looks like, so, yeah. Asimo also said over here that they're going to release a video of, you know, the Blade on BadCC's YouTube channel on Friday or Saturday, so, anyway... Tell me what you guys think about the Blade in the comment section. Do you think this $1 million vehicle is worth it? Or you think it's just not that worth it and it just probably sucks or something? I don't know. But well, only time will tell for me. I will make sure to give my opinion when it comes out. But so far, I don't know the speed or anything. And they, they haven't any, announced any special abilities. But I will be expecting, you know, some special abilities to come with the vehicle. Because every $1 million vehicle sort of has one of those. I mean, I guess you can say the hovering is sort of special ability. But, you know, I'll be expecting, you know, maybe not... 
firing a missile, but, you know, something a little bit more. I I'm not sure, but y you guys get what I'm saying. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. Tell me what you guys think down below, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye!